Hey everyone, it's Rich Man from Rich Man Knows Tech. Does your Roku TV keep disconnecting from Wi-Fi every time you restart it? I'm gonna show you the fix right now. For any of you guys that own one of the popular Roku televisions out now, whether it be TCL, Insignia, or another brand, this fix could really help you out. So a lot of times when you turn your TV off, if you're connected to Wi-Fi instead of, instead of your uh, wired connection, when you turn it back on again and you try to start a program from say Netflix or some other app, you'll get this really annoying pop-up that says you've been disconnected from Wi-Fi or your Wi-Fi is disconnected. Now, when you're right in the middle of trying to watch a program and then you have to go into your settings and you have to go into Wi-Fi and you have to reset it, you have to put your password in again to your router, it's really annoying. So I'm gonna show you the fix right now. So what you wanna do is take your Roku remote and you're gonna hit the home button. So mine kinda went to sleep right there. But, so you're gonna come up to this screen here. I have a TCL Roku TV. And what you want to do, you're, you're on the home screen now, you're going to scroll down. Scroll down till you get the settings. When you get the settings, you're going to scroll over to the right and scroll down till you find system. System right here. Then scroll over to the right and you're going to scroll down a couple of clicks here. Right here, when it gets to where it says power, you see over here, it, it gives you some options. Power on, auto power savings, standby LED, fast TV start, and system restart. What you want though, is the fast TV start. So you're gonna go over to the right, go down the fast TV start, and you see this box right here, make sure you check that and en enable fast TV start. So what that's gonna do is when you turn your TV off, it puts it to sleep and it's gonna remain connected to the internet. So again, if you're connected to the internet via Wi-Fi and not an ethernet cable, say, uh, what that's gonna do is, is keep you connected. So when you, when you turn the TV back on again, it's gonna still be connected to Wi-Fi. So it kind of puts the TV to sleep, but it stays connected the whole time and it, it starts up much faster too. And let me show you what I mean. So I'm gonna turn it off. It's turned off now. When I hit the power button, it comes right back on again. It doesn't take time to start up and that's where the problems come in. So that's it for today, guys. I hope this helps you out with your problem with your Roku TV set disconnecting from Wi-Fi. If you like this kind of content, Make sure you subscribe, smash that like button, and share this video with a friend. This is Rich Man. I'll see you next time.